Hey guys, welcome to my video on Mortal Kombat X, or, well, it, it is 10, but it's Roman numerals for 10, if you didn't know. Uh, sorry if I seem a bit pissed off in this video, I got about halfway through doing one take of it, and the fucking dog barked. So, I'm a little bit pissed, because he ruined what I had going, and if he does it again, I think I might break his neck. Now, I'm not being serious, I'm enraged, but... <sighs> it's a nuisance. Anyway, so we got the announcement trailer today, after all this... Is it happening? Who's next? All this sort of uh, shit. And we finally got the trailer. And um, I watched it instantly the minute it was linked to... Uh, I think it was either Twi someone linked it on Twitter or... Uh, Facebook? That's the one I'm trying to remember. Uh, and I watched it. Um, I was looking forward to seeing what it looked like. And... Wow. <laughs> it's all, my only reaction was... Wow. The If these are the graphics in the game... Mind blowing. Absolutely, simply mind blowing. Like, holy shit. Like, <laughs> I'm, I was shocked watching it. Um, they, I, I kind of had a feeling that uh, this would be a story announcement trailer or something. No, they, what they had was, I'm guessing, just 100% real gameplay of Scorpion and Sub Zero going at it. And it looked incredible. It looked fast paced. It looked fun. It looked fluid. Um, the x-ray moves from the ninth game, the previous one, are back, but they're more realistic and brutal by the looks of it. The bones cracking, everything. Um, even the ending when the, the fatality the Scorpion does on Sub-Zero. Literally, I was like, I was actually like cringing, like, ah, I was like going, oh my god, that's so painful. Because like, I don't know what it was about it, I just saw that and I was like, well, not in a bad way, but I was like, this looked badass. It said it's going to be a next gen. There's going to be a link to the trailer in the bottom if you haven't already seen it. But, wow. It's all I have to say. I hope, I don't want to be a dick, but I hope this game is only on next gen consoles being PS4 and Xbox One. Because, you know, games like Watch Dogs and stuff, the reason that they don't aren't 1080p and full 60 frames or 30 frames, well, 30 frames is fine with me. I could give a shit less about frame rate, but hey, resolution, the same. I could give a shit less, but the reason they're not that 1080p, 60 frames, is because they're having to be made for the old consoles and they're having to be downgraded, and then doing so on that means that they have less, they've had to spread their resources across old consoles and new consoles. So I don't want to be an asshole, but I feel the best way to go about it to make this game the best it can be is just focus on new consoles. Seriously, give us something to play. The only reason these game, these newer games that are coming out, that are coming out and have been out, like Watch Dogs and stuff, are on old consoles, is because there's still people there that are still playing out their old games. There's still, uh, you know, there's nothing new on new gen, like major, well, majority was anyway. So most people haven't bothered to buy a new console, and simply some of them have either no interest or haven't quite got the money for it, which is understandable, and I completely, I, I, I sympathise with you, I do feel really sorry. But if you want these games, until we completely move away from the previous generation and, f and we just move on to the current gen now, this next gen, but it's technically current gen... It, we're not going to see completely 1080p stuff, especially games that are on the old consoles. You see, trust me, games like Evolve, um, what was the other one? I think the new Homefront they announced today, and um, hopefully if this Mortal Kombat comes out, these games are going to look incredible, because they've been designed for these new consoles. The new Call of Duty might look amazing on the new consoles, I'm going to be fair, but that's because it's been designed for these new consoles, then ported down to the old ones. Ghost was a bunch of lies. I knew it was going to be because it's Infinity Ward. What do you expect? But, you know, they said, oh, it's a new engine shit. It looked better. I think it looked better on 360 than it did Xbox One. That's bad. I played it on the, uh, the Xbox 360 for the free demo. And then uh, a friend of mine showed me their recording, for the, some footage of it on PS4. I could have, I honestly felt that the guy who uploaded the PS4 footage, I'm using quotations here like Dr. Evil, it could have just, in brackets, he put PS4. You could have just took that shit out and put 360. Because it looked the same. It looked exactly the same. You know why? Because this game's made for 360 and PS3, and then ported to Wii U, PS4, and 
uh, Xbox One. Mostly been made for 360. This new one has been apparently designed for a new gen console, but because of the partnership with Microsoft, I have a feeling it's going to be made for Xbox One. Uh, and it might not show its full potential on PS4 because of that. So I'm not going to be surprised if the resolution is as the, as the, as good or maybe only a smidge better on PS4 than Xbox One because the power of the, the PS4 is a little bit stronger. I don't give a shit about specs, but it was the cheaper console, and I wanted a new PlayStation anyway, because I didn't like the 360. didn't buy it because it was better. I didn't buy any, any of those reasons. So, in my opinion, anyway. Uh, so, there we go, Madden Morgan Combat I'm getting sidetracked. Uh, the game looked incredible. The far, It was so fast-paced. Um, I saw a load of ice on the trees the minute it starts. I was like, okay, it's Sub-Zero. <laughs> I knew it was going to be Sub-Zero, and I, as soon as I saw the, the burnt tree, I was like, well, that's fucking Scorpion. I mean, it's obvious. It's like fire and ice, you know? The, the two fight each other. Fast-paced, fluid, just, I was sat there, like, jaw-dropped the entire trailer. Um, and I haven't had that reaction on a trailer in a long time. Long time. I feel this is going to be very good. I'm going to probably get this fucking dog, I swear. So I'm going to end this video now before the dog start, keeps barking. But yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Sorry about the dog. I'm going to go have a word now. Uh, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Link below. Bye.